if you are on the east-west line heading towards Jurong East just before you reach the MRT station you'll notice there's this building here this building is called Vision Exchange and as you're passing by you'll notice there are some restaurants and some bars here so I was distracted by this place so I came down here to this place here and explored this place and decided to have something to eat some Korean food yes so we are on the second floor here as you can see this is the MRT track so the MRT passed by here and as you pass by you can see people eating so I decided to drop by to this place here which sells Korean food called Art Tea Korean restaurant and this place here if you come during the weekend you need to make reservations and here is the menu of some of the items that you can order here and so here is the menu and all the items you can order they have some sets that you can order you can also order some alcohol like beer soju not to be eaten together with the dishes here different wide variety of dishes what's really attracted my attention is this they are army stew so you can see you are cooking it right in front of you look at the fire there cooking heating up the army stew you can see sausages you can see some vegetables like meat or maybe scallions inoki mushroom there's also luncheon meat in there uh, pork pieces pork belly pieces and also tok or rice cake and a bit of tofu too and I also ordered some what you call this? This is their seafood pancake. Yes, the seafood pancake. Ooh, look at this, the dipping sauce. A side dish that we ordered to be eaten together with my meal. That's because you know why? Just having the stew is not enough. I need to have more. Because I am a growing, growing, growing boy. And then of course some of the side dishes. This is moo or pickled radish that goes together with your fried chicken. Then you have your kimchi. Yes, the cabbage kimchi. Then you have some uh, cucumber and some pickled onions. I must say, I do like the kimchi. The kimchi has a nice flavor to it. The pickled onions too. I think they did it themselves. Quite nice. So let's start with some of the side dishes while we're waiting for the army stew to cook. So this is the seafood pancake uh, do be careful once when it arrive it is still very hot and i must say yes i do say that it's nice and crispy i do like the flavor just that uh, not not a lot of seafood in there but still quite good i do like it the pickled radish is also not too bad some kimchi yes kimchi it has a nice flavor a bit a bit spicy quite sour but nice what else do we have here oh yes this is what we have i ordered again their yeah, fried chicken look at this with the yam yang myon yang myon seasoning which is sweet and spicy and crispy and look at that doesn't that look good this is the half portion of chicken fried chicken so i'm going to get some fried chicken and i'm going to bite into it Ooh, i must say i do like it the seasoning nice sweet spicy clings onto the chicken the chicken also super crispy but what i really like is the chicken i ordered the boneless portion the boneless one so there's no bones in there but they do it really well it's still nice and juicy on the inside succulent big pieces of fried chicken and the batter still crispy i really really do like the fried chicken here the chicken here they did very very well 
I would come back here because you know why? There are still other flavors of fried chicken that I haven't tried yet. And definitely, from what I taste here, I'm sure the other fried chicken will taste just as good, as juicy, as succulent, as yummy as the chicken I'm eating now. Mmm! Damn! That is a very, very good fried chicken. Better than a lot I've tried in Singapore. And as you can see, the army still is starting to boil, so we can start to eat it. Ooh, look at that. Lots of... Lots of sausages and pork. I think it's pork belly in there. Taofu. Some... Scallions. Banchan meat. And of course, rice cake. Ooh, can't wait to dig it. And because, you know, eating the stew by itself is not enough, we actually ordered some instant noodle to be added into the stew. And once it's cooked, it's nice. And the... How do I say? The army stew stock you know, flavors the instant noodle very well, goes very well together. I really do like it. And then what else is there? Oh yes, the ingredients there also done very well. I do like the flavor of the army stew. It's quite nice. It is very, very, very nice. Just that it is a bit hot, so you need to blow on it. Overall, I must say, this place here does cook good Korean food. Only thing is, it is a bit pricey. The whole meal for three people cost me around 85 90 I think, if I'm not mistaken. But, a good meal. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this. As per usual, like, share and subscribe. I got Patreon, I also got PayPal. Support me on those or watch some of my old videos. And lastly, but the most important thing, the thing that you have to do is to join me for my next adventure. I will see you all around. Bye-bye.